Greetings, family. I trust that you are all well by the special grace of the living God. I am so blessed. It is really such a great blessing to connect with you once again via this video in the name of Jesus. Wonderful people of the Most High God, today I want to discuss the most, I believe, common and important uh, prophetic symbol that appears in our dreams. And I believe this one we cannot ignore. Have you ever dreamt of a, of a vehicle do you know what it means a vehicle has got such an important significance as you see it in a dream and today in this video i will be dealing just with that and i believe that by the grace of god this will be so gratefully um, impactful in your life and you will bless the lord for it and you will be able to gain insight whenever you see an image of any vehicle in your dream people of god i want you to understand that when you dream of a vehicle is it a car is it a bus is it a train is it a bike? Is it an aeroplane? Whatever it could be. These are symbols that appear in our dreams frequently. We have to know the meaning because the meaning behind a vehicle, it is so much important. It talks about your destiny. It talks about your movement. I want you to know that dreams are usually a symbolic language. God will speak to us in dreams in a form of images. We need to be able to interpret those images by the Spirit of God and know what is God trying to say. This, these images can come in a form of objects, animals, and even some people, as you see them in a dream, can represent a concept, can represent an idea. Imagery is a way in which God communicates a message and by you seeing certain images in your dream and you are unable to interpret them you could be missing out on a very important message connecting to your destiny and today by the special grace of the living god i believe that today someone is going to be helped people of god i want you to understand that when you see a vehicle in your dream you need to know what does a vehicle do be able to identify a vehicle to say a vehicle is a is a is a way of transportation it moves a person from one point to the next it doesn't matter the type of vehicle it doesn't matter how many people it carries that is now a second level of interpretation but the first point of it it represents movement and i want you to know that this can relate to your destiny you need to understand for you to be able to interpret this what does this car represent what does this bus represent what does this train in my dream re represent is it stuck is it taking me somewhere has it crushed on the way what's happening am i waiting for someone i'm in this car and this person is not coming once you begin to ask those questions around that vehicle you are able to then get a proper interpretation that god is bringing to you are you inside that vehicle what sort of people are you with are, are you feeling secure with those people do you know those people are you feeling insecure with them things like that have got to be answered and people of god i want you to know that as you see this symbol i want you to understand that this symbol carries answers regarding your life it carries answers regarding your destiny and when we look at that we need to understand and ask ourselves my god in my life what are you trying to communicate what are you trying to tell me regarding the scenario i'm seeing in the stream concerning my life in this car that I'm in, in this bus that I'm in, what is happening inside? Have I reached my destination or have I stopped halfway or I didn't see where I've ended up to? That could mean your destiny. Or is this car stuck? It is not moving anymore. That could mean very much your destiny. And people of the living God, I want you to understand 
that when you see a car being stuck on the way it talks about you know hurdles that you might experience on the way that will prevent you from reaching to your destiny when you see it crash it means that there is a force that is coming to you that will prevent you to also reach that particular destination i want to speak of something here there was um an article that I was reading, you know, based on the same thing again. And this, they were giving this example of this woman to say this woman was in the car at the back seat of a car and the husband had passed away for some years. And this woman was just sitting there because the husband was usually driving her, waiting for the husband to come and drive the car. But the husband did not appear. The husband was nowhere to be seen. She kept on having that dream over and over and over again. But now when you look at this woman, her life is not going anywhere. Her life is moving in circles. So what does that dream say? The dream says that the driver's seat is open. Instead of you just sitting at the back while this person in reality has passed on you need to therefore move from the back seat go into the driver's seat and begin to drive that car so that there can be forward movement in your life and people of the living god i'm going to give another example before you know i started ministering and coming into ministry i was fully working full-time job and whenever i would dream i would see myself driving a normal car and i would be just by myself and when the time came for god to call me to be ministering to the people of god doing his work working in ministry the dream changed and i started seeing myself as if I'm in a bus and in this bus, there are many people in it and yet it's like I'm driving it. For a long time, I did not understand why am I seeing this? Why am I not seeing myself in the car again that I'm driving alone? Why am I driving these people, you know, so many people in this bus? What did it mean? The interpretation was speaking about the change in destiny. To say just for you pursuing a career that is just by yourself, moving from one place to the other. You are, God is now taking you to a level or you have to step in your purpose in life, in terms of ministry, where not just you are moving, but you are now taking that responsibility to take the children of God to their final destination by the Spirit of God, leading the way through prayer, through the Word of God, through teachings of God, causing them to reach their final destination. I don't know if people understand this, but this prophetic symbol, it is so much important of seeing vehicles in your dream. If you are dreaming and you see a car crash, you see a car getting stuck, you know, you see um, yourself not going anywhere, not reaching your destination. It means you need to pray against the spirit of stagnation, against forces that will come and hinder your next level in the journey of life. And people of God, I believe that today you have been blessed. The power of God has worked for you to understand more about this because vehicles in a dream is a prophetic symbol that talks about your own life. And many a times God has used this symbol to speak to me regarding my destiny, regarding my family, regarding my life. And God uses this symbol to send to me messages regarding my ministry, messages regarding my career, just using this symbol, talking about the travel, moving, not necessarily tra traveling, but about the progress, even of the career, even of the ministry, even of my personal life from one point to the other. And I want you to understand, people of God, that this is the way God communicates to us in dreams and vehicles speak to us about where we are going in life you need to watch out for them in your dreams you need to be able to interpret what you are seeing concerning 
any vehicle that appears in your dream by the spirit of the living God. Because if you fail to interpret that, you could miss out on a very important message, a very important message. And it has happened that uh, sometimes I would, I would see myself dreaming and I have a number of people that I know in a particular vehicle. It has happened to me, you know, not long ago where I see there's a number of people in a vehicle that I know where we start a journey and we are moving. And these people are so close to me. And all of a sudden, you know, I don't see those people as we reach the destination. I don't know what has happened to them. And when I look into the reality of life, you know, by God's ways, you know, you find that those people have been removed out of my life. Not that they're bad people, some of them, but they, there could be a reason to say, you know what, the people that are there, you, you might not be needed for their next level. They might not be needed for my next level. When there is a change of level, sometimes there are people that will not go to you in that level. There are people that will reach the destination with you. There are people that are going to get off the way. And when you dream of such dreams, it is an, a spiritual alert or a spiritual message is being communicated to you. Maybe God can see that you are so much attached to a certain person. And this person does not think good of you. This person is not going to be with you for long. And a dream will drop there concerning a vehicle because a vehicle is movement in life it is about your destiny and you just see you are driving with this person you are going somewhere but when you reach the destination the person you started with regarding that journey is no longer there at the final destination you look for them you look for them you can't see them so dreams concerning vehicles mean a lot and today I felt it deep down that I needed to deal with this because this prophetic symbol appears so much to us it appears so much to us sometimes people will see it see in in, in their dreams you know that someone is you, you know you are driving and you pick someone along the road and as you move with them the car crashes you are getting a warning some people, you know, you know them as they come in the car or the bus or the flight or whatever it is. Some people you don't know. You are simply getting a warning. If it's a person you know, it means that you need to be careful of that person. If it's people um, you don't know, it means someone new might be coming in your life with wrong intentions to cause havoc. Therefore, it is a spiritual alarm that you be alerted of. And today, people of God, I trust that you've been blessed. I trust that this is going to make so much of a difference in your life. I'm still going to discuss on other prophetic symbols, but I felt this one deserves a separate video because it means so much. It is about your life. It is about your destiny. It is about you moving from one point to the other. A vehicle is a means of transportation. It talks about your speed. Sometimes you see yourself in a train. You sleep, you wake up. You sleep, you wake up. You're still on a journey, which means the road that leads to where you are trying to get to, it's going to take, a, you know, some time. It's going to be long. And God is trying to show all these things in the journey of life. It represents sometimes snail movements along the journey of life. And you are then able to say, let me engage in prayer and begin to ask God for acceleration. Break the spirit of slow movement and ask God for acceleration to my God-ordained destiny in Jesus' mighty name. People of the Most High God, I trust that you've been blessed by this video. Thank you so much for connecting. Are you here? You have not liked this video. Make sure you like it. Leave your comment down below and I'm going to respond to you. If you have not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe. And you have someone you'd like to share this with. Go ahead and share this video with them. And as you do so, God will bless you. Thank you so much for connecting. May God bless you. Shalom to you all.